New information on the tensions between Ukraine and Russia. Ukraine says Russia has brought in more troops and missiles. Secretary of State Antony Blinken says Russia is planning to increase its military forces on Ukrainian borders. Blinken arrived in Ukraine's capital today. He's under orders from President Biden to reaffirm U.S. commitment to the country. Senator Tommy Tuberville said the U.S. needs to put sanctions on Russia now. Tuberville visited Ukraine in September to meet with the country's president. He said the White House is making a mistake by not acting quickly with sanctions. We need to sanction them now. We, let them, we need to let them know how these sanctions are going to hurt them, how they're going to affect them. We need to be adding them on as we speak, and we can't wait any longer. This week, the White House said sanctions are not off the table. Congressman Robert Adderholt wants to see more leadership from the White House. He tells Way 31 he doesn't believe there is a concrete plan. Adderholt is worried with the possibility of the biggest invasion in Europe since World War II looming. Uh, anytime you have an administration or a president that is waffles and is not strong on, the, on security issues, defense issues, uh, then you'll have people that'll take advantage. And I'm afraid that's what the president of, uh, of Russia is doing, Putin. Ukraine's president addressed his nation today in a video message you see here, telling them not to panic over fears of a possible invasion.